is going on people welcome back johnny here and we are playing some rim world this is the magical mountain menagerie with the dwarfs and it's time everybody's awake except this dude he's not a night owl is he no he isn't nudist but <laughs> anyways let's go to the world map i'm gonna set up the caravan we're gonna start with these dicks Probably should bring my Wand of Resurrection as well. And then... I don't know if we can do a loop and trade with the Empire. And destroy four Beastman bases. That'd be a tall order. But the only way we're going to get to be friendly with the Yobin... These dudes... We need to be allied with them, it says. Where's those quests? That's a pretty... You need an alliance. That means we need plus 100. So, Beastman bases. There's five there. Six, seven, eight, nine. Who else do these dudes hate? Maybe we could come over here and smash these dudes. So if we go look at... F oh yeah, these guys everybody hates. It's the outcast uh, factions are what I'm looking for here. So these are the dudes. Yes. I do hate the dwarfs in the Empire, but we're going to try and play friendly with them all right here we go I'm gonna bring some stuff to trade as well I'm gonna see if I can get my hands on so ooh, we could actually smelt this down for gold but not a lot anyway see if I can get my hands on some healing potions we have some people with wounds that without mechanical limbs or magic limbs I cannot repair so when we're way over what we need for wealth anyways so why don't we just you know we're not even going to get anywhere near what ah, what these values are all right that should be fine we're going to load up a shit ton of pemmican though <laughs> 65 6500 all right let's get it done people horses tromping through eclipse I didn't build any security other than this. The theory being we can just stand over here and pelt them with stones while they're bashing through our walls. And if that doesn't work, well, we could be in trouble. Did I even have a caravan packing spot? I do right there. Why are these horses so damn slow? The other thing is, if they don't pack everything up, like last time they simply didn't do it for some reason. Oh, they're on the way. So let's see, is there any pemmican left? No, maybe they got it all. I guess we'll find out. So, people that are staying here then. I might, do I have any miners? Hmm, Mogul could mine. Oh, shiza. <laughs> they might end up going down on my traps here. I don't have my magic users here, otherwise this is kind of a smorgasbord of wealth, but anyways, I think I'll just, I'll have to set off my traps, it's really going to suck, right? Of course they're going to. Bastards. <laughs> uh, you know they're not going to die from that. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, well. Looks like three of them are going to die. Unless they heal up from that. Do you have any... We have a bow. He wasn't in bed, was he? Here, why don't we man this? I have 20 grudge rits. Let's try and... I think there's overhead mountain there. They're hiding under there. <laughs> I just want to wound that last one, I think. This one. Ah, he's not going to come out of there. Come on, butthead. Ah, he ended up going to sleep over there. Alright, well now they're all pissed off at me. So there's that. I think I'll just shoot at him for a while. And you... Shoot the uninjured one. Let's also make sure nobody steps outside here. This could be catastrophic. <laughs> come home and everybody's dead. We do have to rebuild traps. Fish in a barrel, people. Fish in a barrel. How long till you guys get there? 2.7 days. They didn't end up with as much food as I thought. 
There's a steel site. I could do it. Whose site is it? It is the Gauss Alliance. Which must be the... Ah, uh, gosh. Let's go see if... I don't think smashing that would make these dudes happy. No, they don't really care about the Gauss Alliance. I don't think those are even factions. Hey, we have one of them down. Two of them down. Three of them down. Alright, yeah. Embracers break the game. Just a little tidy up out here. Do need some traps rebuilt. Make sure somebody's on construction. That's gonna be chief importance. I mean, you could actually haul one in now. So we kind of have the double whammy of walking through impassable tiles and old growth forest. So that's why this is so slow. <laughs> it's painful. I don't think they're ever going to make it. Been amusing myself trying to rewrite my runes and I have no idea how I fit this in here the first time. So kind of is what it is, right? These dudes are getting close. Half a day away. That means they're going to get there at 6 p.m. Not not ideal, but there it is. I really hope we find some food here. Jeez Louise, they're going to eat through their other food by the time we get out. Once we get to the road, we should travel faster. We still have to make this jump. Which is not going to be great, but... Hopefully we can smash beastmen. The outcasts can be smashed, and we might actually take some prisoner dwarfs. Jeez, but you don't get the level of wealth you get from the beastmen bases. So there's that. I swear those things weren't there before. I guess maybe they were the whole time. Did that dude just get struck by lightning? Really? Yeah, he did. He's got his neck burned off. <laughs> Uh, take that, you Skaven pig. That's Sigmar striking down Skaven right there. What the hell I'm hearing? Oh, here we go. Here's our custom map being generated. Tells you which one it is, too. Nice. Not that I remember. I made those so long ago. Uh, Dwarf villager Mordrina is the ex-lover of... What is this there, people? Okay, well, that's interesting. There shouldn't be any dwarfs here. Oh, this is an awesome base, by the way. I have outdone myself. <laughs> I should have dragged a stone thrower with in this situation, dude. We could just own face because I don't think there's any doors over here. All right, well, good thing we can actually get over there. Holy shit. I'm going to set up a zone for the animals and get the business here. So this base was supposed to look like the Beastmen took over an empire settlement, and smashed an empire town, turned the people into tents, patched up the buildings and are living there. Cause there are some empire statues and stuff around. Regardless of that, oh, Bindor is so much faster than everybody else, it's absurd. Minor break risk, don't be here for the love of God. We can't have people breaking during this battle. <laughs> All right, so I think we're actually going to have to run around to the north. Sadly, there's nobody over here. We're going to have breaks. Like, it's nighttime. We should have just stayed and waited till morning before we attempted this, I suppose. But here we are. And Skull is on the verge. Bind door. Oh, my God. Brutal outdoors, what does that mean? Oh, they like being indoors. Oh my gosh, I had no idea. And you'd think I would know that because I've been playing these boners for so long. Well, I don't want to send a flame tornado in because that's just going to destroy everything. I think we'll start with... What? Oh, they're in a social fight. Let's start with Berminus Ruin down there. I guess you couldn't do it. Maybe you can't see that position. Where the hell is this guy? Fucking... No. Get over here, dumbass. They're actually swarming us now, and we have no cover. So let's do this. Let's see if we can't get these Ungors dealt with. Let's slow it down. Alright, Typhio, take cover. Bindor, magic. That dude just got his face kicked in, but let's see if we can't drop him with the magic. 
Nice work. That looks like one down. Fucking <laughs> eight. There's a lot left. We need to get this base taken over so we have somewhere to sleep for the night. All right, piercing bolts. Can you target that, dude? Yes. I should probably just keep focusing on magic. Burning blood. Anybody injured? Uh, this dude's going to start shooting at me. I'm just going to focus on the guys that are able to focus on us. Healing light, claw of apex. If I could drop the snare into a big group of them, we'd win this instantly again. Jesus Christ, that guy didn't go down from all that. That's... Oh. Ah, gosh darn it. We could be making new dwarfs. I'm going to focus on dudes that are injured. And I need... A skull will probably drop that dude with one hit, right? Bind or... Boon of Chaos would be nice. Uh, all right, Traceless Demise. Even though he's about to die anyways. Nice work. Okay, breathe fire on this cur here. Alright, here they come. They've taken my rats. My rat sword. Can I cast that same spell again? No, okay. I could do rat thralls. Alright, I think we're running out of options. And now there's a bunch of Minotaur coming at us. You're gonna breathe fire already. That's great. Skull. Abula snare. That's Ooh, this guy has a amazingly awesome weapon that we want oh god it only took out one guy bind door quick <laughs> vision of torment that guy uh we better do something about this son of a bitch here if he hits us we're gonna be in big trouble um no good options piercing bolts shit that's not recharged uh that's a major problem all right, base destroyed. Everybody get out of that dude's way. If he hits me with that axe, it's going to be brutal. Here, hit him. Uh-oh. Did anybody get hit? No. Beautiful. All right. So, anybody need finishing off over here? <laughs> we did it. Uh, I might just leave those guys for now. We can't claim anything, though, until they're all gone, so I guess we might as well deal with them while we're over here. So, Yuvig, finish off Moonfist. I wonder if I can take a prisoner and then use my spell to convert him. Maybe I should do that. There's nowhere to put a prisoner. Here, there's a mighty jade statue. One down. Let's see. So, what did we get with the people? All right, we're at plus 20. Good. Yeah, we're going to be in business here. I'm going to get this mess cleaned up. Once I start exploring, I will uh, come back. All right, well, we can't claim anything. I don't even have anywhere to lay down right now. They are taking these dicks out, which is nice. Because <laughs> this guy, I think, is the reason I can't claim anything here. He's tending. We did take some injuries. I think he had his finger destroyed. Yeah. That's fantastic, right? Everybody's chilling. So until this dude gets dealt with, Skull, Draft, Leap. All right, carry on. We have to get that guy. And maybe I can hit him with this ruby ring. He's going to go around the mountain. We can just leap back with our boots, hopefully. Come on, little buddy, you can do it. <laughs> it's the BS you have to deal with. And... Do that to him. Don't miscast. Jesus Christ. Can you just take the bastard out? Not enough magic power stored. Alright, well, I guess we have to go try and catch him. That's just, he's leaving the map now. Let's go back. <laughs> we have people sleeping on the ground. That's fantastic. Alright. We can claim everything now. Alright. You. Up and at them. These are bedrooms, I think. And they at least will have somewhere to sleep. Thus far, nothing exciting. There's some honey. Ooh, cool. There's some boots of speed. There should be a bed in here, but I can't see it. This is actually a bigger room than it looks. There's some ground roll. Nice. There's a dwarfin head on a spike. 
All right, let's claim all this and see if we can't get people to at least go lay in beds for a minute for the time being. I, th I don't know if there's more stuff back here or not. Definitely is over here. The way these generated mountains, I think, leaves something. Is this just a blueprint or is it an actual wall? Oh, it's an actual wall. <laughs> okay. Uh... All right, go there and there and then there. And then these beds were claimed, right? Okay, so then let's just see if we can get people to lay in the beds. In the dirty old beast man beds. I should at least, oh, there should be more down here actually. Okay, so then the last call is, I guess we have to smash through this. Oh, there's another secret hidden building here. All right, I guess that was another bedroom. <laughs> uh, go, oh my God, what a mess. I don't like when these generate in the mountains, not one bit. Oh, there's a freezing statue. Where's all the stuff that's supposed to be in there? Oh, uh, when it generates in mountains, it has, it doesn't, these things don't generate right when they generate in mountains, actually. Well, that was pretty weak, but I'm almost tempted just to leave the map straight away. Granite Forge, you definitely want that. Let's, I guess, let me see if I can pack all this stuff up without actually putting it in zones and stuff. Oh, wait, we want these too. Uh, these are probably worthless, these beast man rune stones, yeah. Is there one of those beast man freaking axe throwing things around for some rec? We really need recreation, we need meditation, oh shit. Alright, we have to get out of here, because anytime they see these, it counts as seeing a corpse. <laughs> I was also just hoping to get some recreation done. Ugh, shit, that's it. On that note, we have to go. We can't let more Adrena kill our animals. So, we do have alcohol, which is going to be good for us. Uh, we have kibble, but I'm not going to take that, I guess. A lot of honey. So, the fact that the alcohol is not showing up here, I don't know where it, Oh, somebody had it reserved. That's why shit doesn't show up sometimes. That's interesting. All right, I'm going to pack up as much as I can that's worthwhile. There should be a mountain of weapons laying around. I wonder if I have to go add zones. Well, safe to say we cleaned up there. So we'll go trade with these guys, see if we can get some healing potions. Life should be fine. <laughs> I don't even know what's going on back home. Uh, there's a manhunter pack. Uh, good thing they don't fucking fly over the walls. As long as everybody's inside, we're safe. So disallow. Double check. Where's Molgo? Everybody's either sleeping or inside. Yeah, we're safe. Beautiful. Cheers to the patrons. Doug Meyer, Alexander Viking, Brandon Arkinix, Carrie Mahoney, Cornell Boater, Doodle Dave, Joseph Dillingham, Dimitri Rurikid, Ginger Vitus, Josie Genghis Keith, Patrick Johnson, Private Resock, Sebastian Schaefer, Shiggy, Thomas K. Look at my moods. They're in the fucking toilet. <laughs> Natasio, Tyronix, Typhus, David, and Benjamin D. They do have alcohol, so hopefully they can make something worthwhile with that. We also now have no traps. Are these dudes injured? This is going to go on for a little while. Those are some weird shitty noises they make. I don't like it at all. I'm going to try and get to my first trade opportunity here, and then we're going to have to take these dicks out. Beastmen in the old growth forest. That's uh, in their own... In their own <laughs> territory. I don't know if that's going to be great. So the question is, do we go down here? I think that's too far to travel. So what are we at now just in terms of getting this? Okay, we're at negative 61. So we could give them gifts. Yeah, we could just dump a ton of gifts on their in their lap. That's a possibility as well. It'll make things make things go faster. But anyways, so to negative 21, sorry, negative 61 is where we're at now. This will put us at negative 41, negative 21, negative 1, 19, 29. 
So if we smashed all the enemy bases over here and dumped a bunch of gifts in their lap, we might be able to do it. I don't know if we have to travel home or if we can just accept the quest at any time once we get there, but I guess we'll have to see. Oh my god, look at this. It's a bloodbath. A lot of that's probably thrombo blood. Blood of Griffin. That's a bunch of people's blood. Somebody must have been visiting. Yeah, this forest is so stinking slow. It's tough. I'll get there eventually. Mogo's just researching. <laughs> it's got nothing else to do, apparently. I guess I haven't put any construction jobs in. I was debating on putting in all the smoothing jobs, but just not going to bother. Even with everybody gone from the hold, we're still pretty damn close to where we want to be. It's crazy. Yeah, they're not going to be there till the morning. That's pretty sad. And these damn things need to shove off. There's another one dead, though. And that's not rotten. Those get you magical leather, which has high value, strength, and all that. All right, they're finally almost there. <laughs> there is nothing going on here other than snooze festivals. I put in some construction jobs just to pass the time for people. Nobody seems to be doing any mining. Again, I'm really not concerned with them getting anything done. Oh. Well, that's interesting. They showed up when I showed up there. Trade? Okay, so what do we want to buy? I want healing potions, which they don't have. I do have a wand of resurrection. They do have magical limbs. I do have a gold sigil sword, which is excellent quality. Winged boots. I have a dragon orb, which is essentially a heating statue. I'm going to take all this... Beast man stuff made of human leather and break it down. Nice large empire statue. I just don't want to weigh myself down with big heavy statues. So I'm going to pass on those. Silver empire shelf. It's only $462. <laughs> it's a golden royal bed for $15,000. Billiards table. Gold. Alright, we're going to buy all the gold. We'll just sell a bunch of beast man bullshit. Much of these weapons are fine. We don't really need uranium. I brought weapons for selling as well. I really want this too. Let's buy it. <laughs> Assuming we can afford it. I actually I don't see that happening. Four grand. That's a tall order. It would be very useful. Oh look, a magical pickaxe. Oh, Moradrina's gotta have this, dude. All right, well we have to buy that too. <laughs> Can I, oh yeah, buddy, look at that. Let's see if I can figure this out. All right, well, it turns out we can buy all that crap. Gold sigil sword, Grungy's pickaxe. Is there anything I'm selling that I don't really want to sell? Yeah, I think we'll keep the ambrosia. I was selling some of the recreation stuff I had, which I, I'm not enthused about. It's going to hamper my efforts later on. I might as well just sell all this wood. Massive trade. Holy shit. We went up by 20. Alright, so let's get everybody equipped. Some more Adrena. Gets this bad boy. This can make her even an even faster miner. That's glorious. And another gold sigil sword. Skull. Nathgrim. I like this dude with two swords. It's pretty cool. Alaric. Well, I guess I have to give it to Nathgrim. It might not be the best bet based on his skill level, but... Oh, no, that's legit. Okay, cool. All right, carry on. Attack the crevice. It's going to take me 2.1 days to get there. I only have seven days of food. I need a roundup from food. <laughs> that's a problem. I'd, I thought I had plenty of food. So we'll gather some here. We might have to stop and destroy these guys as well, which actually will help our cause, I think. Yeah, okay. So we'll smash this, this, and we'll try and trade with these two guys, and we'll smash this. And if we run out of food, I don't know what we're going to do. It's two days to get there. Well, anyways, please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. Oh, look at this. I guess we can go out there and talk to him. Anybody? Yeah, Logie is. What is wrong with everybody here? Jesus Christ. Ravenously hungry. Ritru. 
I do have a cook. <laughs> Okay, who's assigned to cooking? Was it Mulgo? Oh my god, everybody's eating raw food. Well, that'll get it solved. Anyways, Logi, you're ravenously hungry. Come over here and chat. Where's the dude? No path, okay. That'll solve that. Go trade with the Empire of Man, and you make some goddamn meals. What are you making? Pemmican? Or vegetarian fine meals, making bulk. Pe eh, whatever, that's fine. It'll have mushrooms. They'll eat it and they'll like it, and that'll be just fine. They have fertilized blue crab eggs. We have sixty-two goose eggs. Let's get rid of those. I'm gonna buy a Jabba's life tongue and see if I can't make another magic user. Frickin' belt of ardor. We have to have it. If I have to sell all these old dwarven clothes, we have empire clothes. We have empire hats and hoods. <laughs> I don't really need any of these magical things. A magic light might be useful, but otherwise, not so much. They have medicine as well. That would be really nice. There's some duck eggs that are laying around still. Any human clothes we can just start selling. That's fine. All right, there you go. Let's have a... Uh... He's not a magician yet. <laughs> Consume. He's not going to be happy about this. Uh, receive no bonus. Son of a bitch. Why is he fighting that thing? Oh, it's Manhunter. Like, okay, that was cool. So who would it be best? Probably Mulgo. He's doing our cooking, I think. And, yeah. He force equip. Alright, there you go. Well, anyways, that's going to be it for today. Thanks for watching. I love you all, and I'll see you next time.